Hey guys, your boy B minus, and welcome to the career mode update for April 17th, 2015. And I am exhausted. I am not dead, guys. I just got back from Coachella weekend two, and it was nuts. It was crazy. Here's a short clip of it. Yep, that's me at Drake, and that's me with a burrito, and that is me eating a burrito while watching Drake. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Guys, uh, without further ado, let's get into it. Alright guys, and first up on the career mode updates is this man. He just keeps on getting better every single freaking week. It's Briel Donald Mbolo, the Switzerland 17-year-old. He's getting a plus one, plus one, and he's just, oh my god, just growing every single week. Look at that flow chart right there. Look at his upgrades. Plus one acceleration, plus two, bringing him up to 88 in sprint speed, getting even more agility, and oh my goodness, getting another plus one in strength and plus two to finishing. Small things, small things, but they are really, really helping him out. Every single time anybody ever does a crew mode, you have to just scroll down into the comment section and it's this guy. Mbolo, 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 Mbolo. Next up, perhaps the player of the year in the Bundesliga, and that would be the revelation for Borussia Mönchengladbach, Patrick Herman, the German. The 23-year-old has been lightning in the Bundesliga. Let's go ahead. And as you can see, no real upgrades for him, but let's go and we scroll down into a sense. Some sneaky, sneaky upgrades that just make him set a little bit better. Just set a little bit better. And that is a plus four to his finishing, bringing him up to a ver uh, way more respectable 72 in finishing, as well as a plus three to ball control. Be even better than ever, Patrick Herman. The German. Next up, getting a plus one, plus one this week is another kid. He went on loan to SC Twentieth, but he was originally, um, I think he's on loan from IX, and he's getting a plus one, plus one. As you can see, four star skills, and that would be Balal Olchik. In his stats, getting some nifty, nifty, uh, getting a plus four to sprint speed as well as plus four in dribbling and plus six to ball control. Very well done. The only thing that kind of kills him for me is look at that stamina. I do not know how you can justify playing this guy for more than a half. Fifty-one stamina. He's gonna play one game and then pretty much be out but guys it is slim pickings this week for upgrades i'm telling you that right now blah, blah, blah. next up is this guy holberg i don't know how to pronounce his name but he can play cm cdm cam and he is on loan at fc osberg from bayern munich and he's getting a plus one plus one four star weak foot very nice very nice 18 years old and six one let's go ahead and look you know a little bit tweaking making him a little bit better in the cdm and giving him a little bit better in the mentality uh stats right here nothing all too great but another player just getting that much better in career mode. And last on the upgrade section, it is slim pickings this week, guys. I'm actually giving you an upgrade downgrade in Imo Ezekiel, the Nigerian striker who plays for a standard de Liege is getting a plus one, but a negative one. Let's go ahead and look at his stats. You know, I already love me some pace, but he's getting even better with a plus three in acceleration and plus two agility, so he can really move around. And he's getting the upgrades in the skills position for plus two dribbling and plus two ball control, so he can really move even more. He's going to be almost like an Ahmed Musa clone, guys. Decent stamina, not all that great, but really good jumping, which will help that heading accuracy as well as pretty good finishing and has the technical dribbler trait. You guys want a good young striker, only 20 years old. Emo Ezekiel. I'm not gonna mince words. This was kind of a shitty week for career mode updates. So if you guys are starting career mode, maybe use your old save file. Try not to update, or maybe wait until next week to start that career mode because a lot of the great young staples of career modes got hit with some pretty bad nerf pants. Starting off with this guy, Kingsley Coman, the man at Juventus, is getting a negative three to his potential. As you can see, nothing in his stats has changed, but unfortunately, he's just getting a negative three, which is uh, kind of sucky. Fabian Shar. Unfortunately, he is the man every first January the rolls around you sign this kid automatically because he is the best one of the best good cheap young um, uh, Center back prospects that you can get on a free transfer and it's just a bit of a I don't know, it's a bit of a booty hole that, that he's got to get that negative three to his potential. Let's go ahead and look at his stats. Nothing has changed. Just a negative three to his overall. Still a decent signing, guys, for pre-contract, but just a little bit of a bummer. And another staple from early on in FIFA. As you can see, he started off with a potential of 84, and now he is getting a massive downgrade of negative seven. Once again, none of his stats are, are down. It's just, I don't know, someone at EA must have had a bad week because he was just like, I don't care for youth. I hate potential and just slashed all these guys way way down so I do not know what is going on man and next up is another good young player that is just getting slashed and that would be Romelu 
the Brazilian CDM who plays for Spartak Moscow and he is getting a negative one to his overall and negative four to his potential and let's go ahead and take a look at his stats as you can see getting negatives all along in the defending stats as well as interception and negative four to a ball control still a pretty decent player but with that mm, ah, he used to be in potential of 83 now only at a 79 another one bites the dust guys I don't want to do it it's just getting depressing now but another guy Delling Alley who is pretty Pretty much a staple for almost every Road to Glory series that I have seen on YouTube is getting a massive negative 7 to his potential. If we take a look at his stats, nothing has changed. It's just, oh my god, another one going down and it is a rough week, guys. I'm a little bit depressed now. Oh my gosh, should I stop now? It's just becoming a Game of Thrones episode. Just everyone is getting murdered. All our beloved uh, FIFA career mode kids are getting destroyed. It is might as well be the Red Wedding. Letner, the ex Borussia Dortmund man, is getting a negative one to his potential, a negative two to his potential, and a negative one to his overall. And as you can see, notable downgrades all across. And I don't even, I don't even want to go over this, man. It's this is about a downer. I just went to Coachella and I was all happy and shit. And now I gotta, I had to do this upgrade <laughs> and do this update video. Now I'm just depressed. And thankfully, that is it, guys. There were actually more players, if you believe it or not, that actually got a little bit more of the nerf bat. Um, but yeah, I am back from Coachella. I'm better than ever. I apologize for a little bit of the spottiness in the videos that have been coming out. I promise to get back on track as soon as possible. I uh, got new career modes coming out for you guys, as well as the Hidden Gem uh, Sister Show, which will be coming out on Wednesday. Getting that to you guys ASAP as soon as possible. This has been your boy, B-. I am back from Coachella. I love all y'all. Hopefully you have an amazing day. And remember, stay humble.